Okay, so this video is going to be about uh, creating dichotomous variables, or also known as binary variables. We have a few continuous variables, and we want to uh, transform these into binary for our cluster analysis. So first we're going to be taking a look at age, location, and income, uh, and a few of the other ones that we have in our uh, data set are already binary. All right, so once we go into SBSS, what you're going to do is you're going to come up here to the transport button, click on transform, and then click on recode into different variables. The first one that we're going to be doing is for income. So scroll down towards the bottom here, scroll towards the bottom, and we want to load in income right now. We then, so once income has been loaded, click on old and new values. All right. So we want to specify the range. So the old value, so the range, th the lowest, through to the value. So I want to encode anyone that's 0 to 15,000, and I'm going to give you the new value of 0. Right? Then you'll click on Add here, and a prompt will come up. Now we're going to do um, uh, all other values. We're going to give them the value of 1. Right. Click on Add. Okay. The other way that we could also do this as well too is that we can do uh, 15,001 for the value of 1. That's the other way of doing that as well too. All right. So you can do either option if you want. It doesn't matter which one you go with. It'll work the same. Hit Continue. Now we're going to create a new variable name. So I'm going to call this income cat. And the label name income categorical. Then click change. Okay, and then after you click on change, you'll notice that the name can change and you'll you'll be able to click the OK button. So go ahead and click OK. It'll run some analysis, uh, spit out some data for you. All right, so now we're going to continue that for a few other items. So we're going to do this for age as well. So we're going to go to, uh, again, transform, recode into different variables, unload income cat. I don't want that anymore. Now I'm going to load in age. Load that in. Then click on all the new values. All right. We're going to remove these options here on the right side. For age, I want the range lowest through 21, and I'm going to set that at the new value of 0. Click Add. Then the range value through highest, right, I'm going to select 21. New value of 1. Click Add. And click continue. The name will be age cat and the label will be age categorical. Then click change, then hit OK. And again, you'll get some data. Now we need to do location, so go to transform, recode into different variables. We're going to unload age, scroll down, and load in location. Click on old and new values. For the old value of 1, we will create the new value of 1. Click add and remove these items here. Okay. And for the value of 2 through the highest, We'll set that as zero. Then hit continue. Rename the item as location cat and the variable label name. Then click change. Then click OK. And then, as well too, 
scroll over once you find your data as well too scroll over to the right hand side and you should see if you have major pockets you might have an issue but since these pockets if they never responded for their income it's not an issue that concludes this video